welcome back to my channel in today's video i will be giving this doll a makeover this is the 2011 skipper and chelsea hula doll she's really rare to find and if you have got her then you should feel really lucky because she's really hard to find so i just feel so lucky to have this doll but she is looking a bit beat up so in today's video, we're gonna try and give this doll a makeover. I will be changing a few things. The first bit of the makeover is I'm gonna be starting to give her um, hair a makeover. Her hair is just really like, it won't lay down and it'll just like keep, it keeps puffing up if you get what I mean. And I do have many dolls that have this problem and i am going to try and fix that today another thing that i'm going to try and fix is um over here in this area so basically when i was little um i by accident i broke the doll's arm you can kind of see a difference here and i tried to um i tried to fix it with tape but that didn't really work and it's fixed now um more or less and also on the back is there's a lot of tape and uh, yeah, it's like disgusting, I know, but it's just tape. And I'm going to try and take that off. And we will also be giving this doll a new outfit. I'm not gonna be doing some repaints in today's video, but let's just take a closer look at the doll. This doll's hair is dark brown and it does have one purple streak, which I think is really nice. She has purple eyes with pink eyeshadow and she has pink lips. But one thing that I'm quite disappointed in is I'm pretty sure when I was younger, I was painting and by accident, some of the paint got on her lips and a bit on her nose over there. So that is pretty disappointing, but it wouldn't come off, but we might have luck in today's video. She wears a very colorful cami. A lovely green skirt, which is pretty beat up. I am aware of that. And she also does have these sparkly pants with blue stitches at the bottom. And she does come with some really cute pink flats. I'm pretty sure you call these sandals. And I am a big fan of these. And I do want to mention that this doll has a pretty good range of articulation. She can move at the neck, at the shoulder, at the elbow, at the wrist. However, her joints are getting quite loose. At the hip. And she also does have the bend and snap knee, which is really cool. So this doll has a pretty good range of articulation. Now let's get on with the makeover. And yes, by the way, I did change my yellow color because they were starting to chip. Welcome to the kitchen sink. And I'm going to be um, just rinsing the um, doll's hair. Okay, so I've rinsed the doll hair and um, it doesn't really stay in place. It's still like poofing up. I'm going to try and give her a hairstyle that you can't really see like the poof of the hair like it just like makes the hair lay down um if you get what i mean and um also i just came back from my instagram live and um i let you guys decide what outfit i should give the doll and this is the outfit that you came up with and i'm really happy with it as well and i also decided that i'm gonna give her another little another little accessory and um, I think I'm just gonna put that over here on her hand. Yeah, that looks really cute. Um, so this is the finished doll. And I also did add on some sunglasses. And I do wanna mention that there was a request for silver earrings. I have silver earrings, but I can't take them out. They're like kind of molded onto the doll. And um, so I didn't give her any earrings, but um, I'm pretty happy with how it turned out. And I also want to mention that I kept the shoes because um, that's what you all wanted and that's what you requested. And I'm really happy. Oops. And I'm really happy. And I also gave you the opportunity to like choose a second outfit that was like kind of like a fancier outfit and um i showed you like a lot of dresses and stuff and um 
you all seemed to like this one a lot and um so yeah i'm just gonna go and um switch out the outfit so they can see the dress on a doll so this is the dress i really like it and also i do want to mention that i did try and take the tape off off camera but um it, it didn't work i guess it was really sticky tape i really like this outfit and um this bag actually came with the dress and you know it's a really it's really good i love the dress like how it's like so detailed and like I don't know, I really love it, and um, I also kept the shoes the same because I couldn't find any to like match the dress that good, so I don't know, we're just keeping it like this. And also, I decided what hairstyle to give her. I think I'm gonna give her a bun, because you know, buns are like casual, and they can also be like um, for like occasions, like fancy events, so I'm gonna go and make her hair very quickly, and I'll be back to show you. Okay, so I'm back. I've made the hairstyle and um, I really like it. I think it's really cute with both outfits and this is what it looks like. I'm really happy with um, all of like the features of this doll. And um, yeah, I, I'm really happy with how she turned out. I, I loved all of you all of your suggestions and i'm really sorry that i didn't like get to use all of them i just used what was what was requested the most so that would be fair i really hope you did enjoy this video if you did then make sure to give it a big thumbs up there are no shout outs for today's video but if you are interested in winning a shout out for my next video then all you have to do is subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell and then you have to comment something nice in the comments of my videos with the hashtag dmi fan and you could win a shout out in my next one i really hope that you enjoyed the video i'll see you next time bye